Hey, welcome back to our channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to embed Google business reviews on your website to boost your credibility and your sales. Be sure to check out this post for more details. You'll find a link in the description. The easiest way to add business reviews from sources like Google, Yelp, Trustpilot, TripAdvisor, Facebook, and WordPress.org to your WordPress site is with the Reviews Feed Pro plugin. It has a ton of customization and moderation features, and you don't need to know any code to use it. To get started, just head over to the Smash Balloon pricing page and choose the license level that works best for you. Now, while you're there, be sure to check out Smash Balloon's All Access Bundle, which includes all five of their Pro plugins. But today, I'm just going to be focusing on the Reviews Feed Pro. Now, once you've made your purchase, you'll need to download the plugin and install it to your WordPress site. If you're not familiar with installing plugins, I've left a link in the description to a beginner-friendly guide that will walk you through it step by step. Now, once you've installed and activated the plugin, you'll need to copy your license key from your Smash Balloon account area or your confirmation email, and then paste it in, and then click Activate. Next, you'll need to create a feed for your Google Business Review. So click Reviews Feed in your WordPress menu. Next, click Add New. Now, on the next screen, you'll need to select a source for your review. So select Add Source. Now, you'll see a pop-up asking you to choose which source to use. So we'll select Google and click Next. Now you'll be asked to provide your Google API key. This allows a plugin to automatically fetch new reviews. If you haven't created an API key yet, I'll leave a link in the description to this tutorial. Now once you have an API, just paste it in and click Next. Now you'll be asked to provide your Place ID. If you don't know the Place ID for your business, you can just go to Google's Place ID Finder and find it next to the marker on the map. Now just copy it and paste it into the field. All right, then click Finish. Now we'll customize how the reviews are displayed on your site. You'll have a variety of options to choose from, such as the default layout, which shows your reviews in a list similar to how they look on Google, simple cards, the masonry layout, the single review layout, the showcase carousel layout, carousel, and the grid carousel layout. It's easy to change templates in the next step, so don't worry if you're unsure about which one you should choose. Plus, all the templates can be customized. Now, after selecting your template, just click Next. Now you'll be taken to the editor, which shows a live preview of your Google Reviews feed and customize how it looks. Now to do that, just use the sidebar on the left. Now here you can change the template, layout, edit colors, buttons, the header, and more. Now on the top right, you're going to notice a Write a Review button. Now by default, that link is going to take visitors to write a new Google review on your business, but you can delete the button or you can change it to a custom link if you like. Now to customize it even more, we're going to use the Settings tab and manage which Google Business Reviews are displayed on your site. Sources allows you to add additional platforms to pull business reviews from and show in your feed. The Sort option allows you to choose if reviews are sorted randomly by date or by star rating. You can use filters to exclude or include reviews based on their star rating and keywords found in the reviews. So for example, you could filter out all reviews below three stars and all reviews that have the word bad. And the Languages option allows you to specify which language the reviews should be translated into. Now, once you're done customizing, just click Save in the top right corner. All right, now to embed the reviews on your site, click the Embed button at the top right of the Feed Customizer. You can copy the short code to embed Google reviews anywhere on your site, or you can select Add to a Page or Add to a Widget. To embed your Google reviews on a page, just click the Add to a Page button. The pop-up will then show you a list of available pages to choose from. Select the one that you want and click Add. This is going to automatically take you to the WordPress editor. Then click the plus sign to add a new block. Now just search for and select Reviews Feed. And once you've updated the page, you'll see your embedded Google Reviews feed displayed on your site. Now you can embed reviews in a widget much the same way. Just click the Add to a Widget option. And this will take you to your website's widget customization area. Of course, this is going to depend on the amount of available widgets that you have. Then click the plus sign under the area where you're going to uh, place your widget. Then just search for Reviews Feed and add the block. Remember to click Update after you're done. Now you can view your Google Reviews in the widget area of your site. All right, there you have it. That's how to embed Google Business Reviews on your website. We hope that you found it helpful. Don't forget to check out the links in the description for more details. Thank you for watching, and remember to subscribe for more tutorials, explainers, and helpful content like this. We'll see you next time. See your Google Analytics data in WordPress with Monster Insights. Get 50% off right now and subscribe for more helpful content like this.